NLM Dotana admits to being wet behind the ears when she made the jump from retired Protea to Marty's netball coach in 2017. But she was ready to prove her mettle. The more comfortable you become in an environment, the more you can open up and, uh, and people welcome you in and, and stuff like that. So definitely much better now than what it was. As a local coach, Mdotana knows her responsibilities go beyond the Western Cape. The scene is being set for South African netball to step up ahead of the 2023 World Cup in Cape Town. We cannot be having four players of colour in 2023 playing in the spa proteas. Then we wouldn't have done our work. We wouldn't have planned, we wouldn't have prepared, we wouldn't have found the talent and made sure we nurture it. Progress in netball over the past few years has been helped in part by those vocal about the sport. Dotana is one of the leading voices speaking out. She says the sport's current administration has helped by not silencing her strong opinions. We want to give everybody an opportunity that deserves it to, to play for South Africa. Um, and a whole lot of hard work has come in, you know, as a whole lot of people have fought this, this fight for so long and we will never, we'll never stop fighting it until we see the results. Mdotana is seeing some results at a local level. Marty's placed second in the varsity netball competition in what's been a breakthrough year. Klonim Timkulu, Johannesburg.